So, here's the deal. I know I'm currently playing Subnautica, but I thought, you know what, I play Warzone a lot, so why not make a video on it? And here we are. So, there's not much more to say, so we're just gonna start a solo match. I don't know what's going on with the background right now, it looks like some trees are glitching, but yeah, we're cool with that. Now, heads up, when you watch me play Warzone, you're gonna notice I land hospital more than any other place. And that's mainly because it has a decent balance of loot and enemy players, so... Oh god. So yeah, hospital seems to be the best place to land for a decent gameplay view. Battle Royale! Be advised, gas is closing uh, hello? in. Proceed to the safe zone. Okay, there we go. Uh, airports to FNL, why not? Wow. <laughs> no, right away. Now. Right I do to time. Oh, look at this guy. He needs some. You win this fight and you return to the front line. But if you lose, you're done here. Time to earn your freedom, sir. Hold up. You gave him a proper sword. Stand by for redeployment. That guy's gonna be ready in seconds. Never mind. Oh, and something that they should definitely add to this game. When you die or lose a match, they gotta have it so that you can ready up in-game. That makes it so much easier. They have that in Fortnite. And then you don't have to leave, go back to the lobby. It, everything just works out so much smoother. By the way, this is the best loadout. Um, if you disagree, then you're wrong. Uh, M4A1. All these stats. And uh, yeah, the AX50. There's no better loadout than this. Bro, oh. oh, I'm so cool. Watch Look at that. I can do that. I'm so cool. What is this gun, bro? What? Another thing, this plane animation is sick and all, but it kind of gets annoying after a few rounds. It takes up time. I love the guy talking with the British accent, or it's Australian. I really don't know the difference. Rip. See, look at all this loot up here. I mean, I'm telling you, hospitals gotta be the best drop. If you use a shotgun in this game, then there's something wrong with you because shotguns are physically the worst weapon in this game. I mean, they have very little use because the map is such so big. I mean, it's a battle royale themed map. And, you know, I mean, I, I can see why you'd use it in like a 4v4, like a... Like the normal modern warfare, but like here, the map is just huge, so I don't really get the point. And then once you reach the top of the tower at hospital, you slide down here. And you just get so much loot. And then you slide down here. And look at this. Look at all the shield I have already. And watch this perfectly placed thermite. I know that would have been cool, but. Ooh, precision airstrike. You know what? I'm gonna launch on these guys right now, because why not? Enemy you know? dropping into the AO. Full fire. Charge missed. This gun is too OP, and that guy in the car just took my kill. Hostile vehicle! Oh wait, I have a rocket launcher. No way that hits. No way that hits. That's sick. I never really use the Pila. I always use the uh, normal RPG-7 because I love how it, can, it doesn't track, so you can actually hit like decent trick shots. Oh, I just heard someone take the zipline up. Oh. 
Uh, recons, the they're easily the best. Ta I don't know what you call them. You know how you pick up the, uh, the uh, hunting, the, the, uh, uh, um, what's it called? The, uh, bounty, and then the scavenger, and the recon. Recon's easily the best because they're easy. It's only one, and not, you don't have to find like three crates. And it shows you where the next storm eye is, which is the best thing in the world. Because if you spawn, if you like land right on five of these of those and you get them right away you can get the circle down and be so small it can just be on one house left just camp over the whole game until the very end and then you have an easy win i'm not about camping i'm about going and fighting everyone because you know that's the best way to have experience but i hate recons when they're out in the open because then everyone around you sees that and yeah you're pretty much screwed if someone comes up behind you Recon intel secure, solid too. work. Whoa, look at this thing. I hey, whenever I can take a sniper for a rocket launcher, I always do it. Because, you know, it's cooler shots if you can hit with a snipe than a rocket launcher. Enemy team is tracking your position. Oh, damn. They should make it with bounties where, like, when someone can see where you are on the map, you can see where they are. I mean, I guess it's kind of like that with the threat level, but other than that, it's pretty hard to tell where they are. I mean, how is this guy going to get to me, though? Because this is, like, the only way up through this ladder. Oh, there he is. He's like, what? Oh, my God, that aim. I want to snipe this guy again. He's so confused. Wait, do I have a grenade? Yeah, here we go. Oh, God. <laughs> How did he get over there? Peek, please. Wait, watch this. Oh, sick tricks. No. Enemy UAV overhead. Oh no. I want to get him with the snipe so bad. There we go. Oh, so I'm trying to shoot. No, what? Hey, uh, if you survive, you earn your freedom. You can practice your aim on your way. Really the enemy, British guy says he lags. Oh, what is this? He's a little place stun? Does he, does he mean stone? I don't know. Rip. That could have been the same person that I just killed the night before. I wouldn't doubt it. Mm, loadout drop. Run, run. I hate loadout drops only for that reason, because then you're out in the open. This is the best loadout by far. The thermal scope, it's so great, because if you're like up high, you're trying to look for people out in the open, you just make one skin like that, and it automatically shows wherever the people are. Unless they have like ghosts or something like that, but still, it's pretty OP. Uh, I hate going out in the open. Oh wait, is that a guy? No, that's a smoke. Wait, isn't this where I died? Moving up there. All right, I don't like driving much, but when I do drive, it gets crazy. So my viewers probably like crazy, so that's why I'm doing this. Nope. Oh, meant to do that. Oh, I hear someone here. Yep. Oh crap. Are they up here? Yeah, they are. Oh, God. I want to snipe this dude. Oh, this is so difficult. If I just slide over here? Enemy UAV overhead. Oh, what? Learn from the loss. Failure's a proper teacher. No, there was a dude there? Uh, oh yeah, and this is the best character, only because of that nice big beard. Any character who has a beard in the game is obviously one of the best characters. Oh, secondary grenade launcher. Alright. They can hit someone out of midair.
Hello there. Oh, I've never seen so many people. What? I want to see this. Oh, we got a rocket launcher. Oh, did you get a double kill? I love how you can spray Point people. Like one of the best things in the gulag. You want to fist fight? Come on, fight me. Sort them out or capture the objective. I kind of like how in Warzone there's no building like there is in Fortnite because then you go up against that one 12 year old kid who can build like a mansion with a fountain in like five seconds and you can't do anything because you're not that sweaty and you don't play video games all day. Oh god. Learn from the loss. Failure's a proper teacher. And guys, I think that's going to be the end of Warzone today. If you are enjoying, like, subscribe, and new content will be coming out soon. But if you need some now, then I had posted a Warzone video a couple days before this. Pretty much my best clip so far. But I'll try to get more, upload more. So yeah, uh, more videos should be coming soon. Other than that, thank you for watching, and later.